Hello everybody, we're getting ready to do lesson 2.7 part 3 homework today for pre-calculus math. Email me here for questions or course materials. Um, we got 106 points here of homework assignment on part 3. Okay, here we are with page 1 of 2.7 part 3 homework. Use the graph, and these are the graphs here that you need to critique and estimate any x-intercepts, put that in these response boxes here, or attach a sheet to this homework. This homework's pretty involved, so attach a sheet. But put your responses up here on this answer sheet here. And solve the resulting equation to confirm your result. Put the solutions of your equations up here, like here, and then here. Eight points for page Okay, on to page two here of the homework, and we have uh, three situations here where number one, you're going to graph these, and then two, determine the domain of the function, and put that domain in here or on an attached sheet. This is your answer sheet. I'm really interested in the, in the graphs here, but it wants you to put the domain of the function and identify any asymptotes. You can do that on the graph here as well. Eight points for here. Find all vertical asymptotes of these functions here. Slant asymptotes, holes in the graph of the function. Then use a graphing utility to verify your result. So put those here. Uh, vertical, horizontal, and slant asymptotes and holes. Put those in these uh, response boxes here. This is your answer sheet. Then page four. Uh, use a graphing calculator to graph the function. Determine any x-intercepts. You can do that on your graphs here. Set y equals 0, then solve the resulting equation to confirm your result. And so that's just a confirm, but the important thing here is to graph these on these grids. And this is your answer sheet, so I expect to see the graphs here. And then you can identify x-intercepts, etc on your graph. Same thing here, page 5, identify any x-intercepts, but graph these functions on these grids. And then page 6, uh, graph these functions uh, on these grids. Then page 7, uh, you got a word problem here. So determine the domain, show the concentration. And then page 8, finish up this word problem here. Use a graphing utility graph function. What percent of the concentration of the brine appear to approach? So that is your 2.7 part 3 homework of pre-calculus math. Email me here for uh, materials or questions. Thank you very much.